What's going on, everybody? How you doing? My name is Dr. Sami Baya, the relationship expert. Now, signs that the man you're dating, the man you are seeing, the man you're going out with, he's not a marriage material. He's not a husband material. You should not consider marriage with that guy you are seeing if they will exhibit the following things. Number one, you don't share the same beliefs and values. If your beliefs and values do not align with the man that you hope to be your future husband, let me warn you, don't consider marriage because you will most likely be in disagreement. If you if you if you can stick with that relationship, what will happen when you start having children? Whose values will be instilled in those children? Whose religion will be followed? These things might appear to be minor at the beginning of the relationship but once things become serious real and when the children are, are get involved things worsen there will be a lot of disagreements and conflict so if you're considering marriage look at that person do you share the same beliefs and values now uh, does he support your needs you see if you are in a relationship, you should not feel as if you are alone. You should not be in a relationship and feel single. If you have a partner, he must, he should be able to take care of your needs. Even if it is the smallest way possible. If you cannot, if your partner cannot support your needs, cannot take care of your needs, even if it is in the smallest way possible, then you should not consider that person for marriage. If you, your partner lies to you, if you've caught him lying to you, and they don't care how it hurts you, that is not someone you should consider them for marriage. You see, if you have someone whom you also can't talk anything serious with, you can't have a serious conversation with them, why are you even together? That means he doesn't take you seriously and that is someone you cannot confide in. If he's a cheat, once a cheat, always a cheat. If he's a cheater, if you marry a cheating man, you'll be in trouble, you'll be in hot soup. If you marry that kind of a man, you will suffer in your marriage, you'll cry. You'll cry and cry and cry. I wish you all the best if you decide to marry a cheater. So if you also have someone who has no sense of commitment, he just wants to use you and misuse you and then later on discard you. You know, he's using you for his own, in con his own convenience and nothing more. That is not a husband material. So if you have someone who doesn't like sharing their shows, their house calls, they believe that they should not do anything in a relationship that it's up to you up to you the woman to do then that's a warning it's a red flag so if he's already a problem during the dating stage what about when you're married hey thank you for watching this video please subscribe to my youtube channel if you've not done so subscribe 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 thank you